The Shoalhaven scheme is a dual-purpose water supply and hydroelectric power generation scheme located on the south coast region of New South Wales, Australia. The scheme was built as a joint project between the Electricity Commission of NSW and the NSW Metropolitan Water Sewerage and Drainage Board. Management has subsequently passed to Erraring Energy and the Sydney Catchment Authority. Water supply Water in the scheme is stored in three principal dams and their associated reservoirs, Taloa Dam, Fitzroy Falls Dam and Winchcarabi Dam. Winchcarabi River is a tributary of Warragamba River, so water pumped into Winchcarabi Reservoir can be released into Warragamba Dam and hence the Sydney water supply. Water can also be released into Nepian Dam via a system of rock cuttings and tunnels known as Glencorey Cut. Water from the Nepian Dam can be transferred to Sydney, or to Wollongong via Avon Dam. <inaudible> Bendila Pondage Bendila Pondage, completed in 1972, is an earth and rockfill embankment dam structure located on the Kangaroo River. Topic: Power generation. In addition to its water supply capabilities, which supplements water supplies to the Sydney area, the Shoalhaven scheme also comprises two hydro power facilities with total generating capacity of 240 megawatts (320,000 horsepower). The flexibility of the scheme is that it can operate as either a pump or a generator. During off-peak periods, it utilizes excess electricity from the grid to pump water back up to the reservoirs as pumped storage. The two power stations are, the Kangaroo Valley and Bendila power stations were completed in 1977 as a joint project between the Electricity Commission of New South Wales and the NSW Metropolitan Water Sewerage and Drainage Board. Management has subsequently been passed from those bodies to Erraring Energy and the Sydney Catchment Authority. Topic: <laughs> Kangaroo Valley Power Station. Kangaroo Valley Power Station in the Kangaroo Valley has two 80 megawatt, 110,000 horsepower pump turbines for a total electricity generating capacity of 160 megawatts, 210,000 horsepower. From Bendila Pondage, the Kangaroo Valley Pumping and Power Station lifts water a further 480 meters, 1,570 feet, to Fitzroy Falls Reservoir via a tunnel, shaft, pipeline, and canal. Water available for hydroelectric power generation is discharged back down the conduits, driving turbines as it returns to Bendila Pondage and then Lake Yarunga. Bendila Power Station Bendila Power Station has two 40 MW pump turbines, for a total of 80 MW of electricity generating capacity. Bendila Pumping and Power Station, located on the Kangaroo River arm of Lake Yarunga, lifts water 127 metres 417 feet to Bendila Pondage. <inaudible> <inaudible> environmental consequences The Shoalhaven River and its main tributary the Kangaroo River Taloa Dam has been a barrier to migratory native fish with estuarine, marine juvenile stages, blocking species including Australian base from more than 80% of their former range in the Shoalhaven system. Stockings of hatchery bread base in Lake Yarunga has been an attempt to remediate the situation. A fishway for Taloa Dam has been discussed for more than 20 years but was not constructed until 2009. Lake Yarunga also contains exotic species such as carp, which are now present in high densities. 
A fish lift began operation in August 2009. Topic. See also. List of reservoirs and dams in Australia